Hey guys, and welcome back to the voice for the people speak. Before we get into this video, make sure you hit that subscribe button as well as hit that bell so you can be notified every time I put up a video. It has recently been announced that Stephen Curry just signed a $201 million contract with Golden State Warriors. For all bad groupies, you know his wife, don't play that. Stephen Curry is 29 years old and he holds a career average of 22.8 points. 6.8 assists, 4.4 rebounds, and 1.8 steals per game over his eight seasons. So he's worth this $201 million, okay? For the next five years, he will be with the Golden State. The owner of the Golden State, Joe, is said he's doing everything possible to make Curry happy. $201 million definitely makes me happy. Not only is Curry breaking records on the court, but he's also breaking records in the bank because he is the highest paid, paid NBA player in history. If you're curious to know the top 10 richest contracts in NBA history, which is of course underneath Steph Curry now, Chris Bosh comes in at number 10 with a contract of $109 million with Miami Heat. LeBron James comes in at number 9 with a contract of $110 million with Miami Heat. Gilbert comes in at number 8 with a contract of $111 million with Washington Wizards. Shaquille O'Neal comes in at number 7 with a contract of of $120 million with LA Lakers. Tim Duncan comes in with a contract of $122 million, San Antonio Spurs. Chris Webber comes in at number five with a contract of $122 million with Sacramento Kings. Lewis comes in at number four with a contract of $126 million from Orlando Magic. Kevin Garnett comes in at number three with a contract of $126 million with Minnesota Timberwolves. Jermaine O'Neal comes in at number two with a contract of $126 million with Indiana Pacers. Kobe Bryant comes in at number one with a contract of $136 million with LA Lakers. And I know a lot of you are wondering why is it Michael Jordan on this top 10 highest paid being that he's one of the greats. If we're doing it by seasons rather than a five year contract, Michael Jordan would have been the top 10 highest paid per season. Back in 1997 to 1998, he was paid $33 million in one season. But wait, it didn't beat Stephen Curry contract because if we divide $201 million divided by five, he will be getting paid $40 million per year, which is seven million more than Michael Jordan. And speaking of one of the greats, LeBron was not in his feelings this time. He did congratulate Stephen Curry on Twitter. So congratulations to Stephen Curry. If you like videos like this, make sure you comment that down below and like this video. Until next time, peace.